Hi boys and girls! Welcome again! This is a tutorial, as I promised you, how to make a blue bird out of a Play-Doh. So here we have blue Play-Doh and light orange Play-Doh. And so what we're gonna do, we're gonna divide Play-Doh in some small parts. By the way, those are the local birds singing for us today. All kinds of serenades. So I'm gonna start with a bigger, rather bigger piece of Play-Doh and I'm gonna make it into a bowl like this. I'm gonna put it in my palm and I'm gonna roll it or you can roll it as Sophie is doing on a table. I like how the Play-Doh feels on my palm. And now I have pretty much a circle. So I'm gonna maybe make it a little, squish it like this, this little bowl. And this is gonna be a body of our bird. Now we need, clearly we need a head. So I'm gonna use another piece of Play-Doh for the head and I'm again, I'm gonna make a bowl out of it. And this is gonna help us to make the bird's uh, head. My Play-Doh is a little dry, so I'm gonna try again. Oh, those birds are so talented. They sing so well. Okay, so this is the head of my bird. I'm gonna put it right on top of the body, like this. Hopefully it stays. Okay, now, our bird, to be able to fly, needs to have wings. And so I'm gonna take one piece of Play-Doh and flatten it and make it, I'm gonna show you right here, make it really, really flat. This is gonna be one wing and you can design it however you want, fancy or just regular. And we're gonna put it on one side. And then I'm gonna take another bowl of Play-Doh and flatten it. And that will be another wing. So if you remember well, birds have lots of feathers. You can actually decorate your wings with um, different colors different colors if you would like i'm gonna keep it simple so for those who are more advanced and play-doh techniques you can definitely put extra touches on it now so, how our bird needs to fly it needs eyes or it's gonna bump into something if it doesn't have eyes so we're gonna take two tiny little orange balls and we're gonna roll them up to make eyes All right, so we're gonna make tiny little balls and gonna put eyes on our bird. And it does not need to be perfect. No, it doesn't. As long as the bird can see where she's going, it's already good. So now the next step is very important. We are going to make a beak for our bird so she can, or he can eat. So again, I took a little tiny piece and I'm gonna kind of squish it and you make it a little, your nose as however little you want. pointy. And now we have, the bird has already a big two eyes and now what it needs it's very important, it needs feet. feet. So again, I took a piece of Play-Doh, I divided it into little pieces, and I'm gonna put them right on the bottom, right here, one foot, another one. Okay, birdie, now you can sit down and sing. I think my bird is almost ready the only its thing flight. it's missing, I think, is his tail. Oh my goodness! So the tail can be different colors as well. We chose to do it in the orange color. A simple color. And you can make yours fancy or just plain normal. All right. 
So I took another piece of plate and I'm gonna squish it again, make it very flat. And I'm gonna point one part of it and the other part I'm gonna leave it kind of flat so it will look like this. And it I'm doing like a fancy this. tail with little marks in it. Oh, how fun. And I'm gonna connect it right here in the back of the bird. So our Play-Doh is a little dry, so it periodically is falling apart, but we do not give up. We keep trying, right, Sophie? Yep. Okay, so now we have a mama bluebird. And a baby bluebird. Hello. Hi, mommy. Okay, friends. Now, as you try to make a bluebird with us, you can enjoy and have fun with your little bluebird. Bye. Bye.